we get underway in Peru this evening, the 2024 campaign of the Combipol Sudamericana group stage kicks off on match day one with the Jose Vallejo playing from right to left on your screen in the orange and blue strip. Uh, Defensa e Justicia, the on the road Argentinians playing in the yellow shirts with the black trim, black shorts and yellow and black socks. Guerrero looking to make an immediate impact for his new club in this group stage, shifts it out wide. Pinging around inside the 18-yard box and the acrobatics coming in. Comfortable save, however, for Christopher Piermarin. Oscar Barreto. Guerrero. This is wonderful work around the top of the 18-yard box. And Vélez can't finish it off. First heart-in-the-mouth moment for the home supporters. Physical as it is in there. As the keeper came and didn't get to it, Carlos Grados. He encounters just a couple of games ago. Looking for three and three here, perhaps hit. A strong sliding challenge coming in from Santiago Ramos Mingo. Well waited past that by Guerrero. Benham was able just to hold up his run enough to make sure he didn't drift offside and got on the same wavelength as his strike partner. Just keep an eye on Mena in the middle. He's the only one to aim at. He's going to get to it too! Mistakes at the back unpunished. Well, it came out of nowhere, really, the chance. Some pretty torrid defending in that back line. Velez's ball slips all the way through to the man who. And that's the half time whistle. Goalless here in Peru. The opening game of Group A in the Common Ball, Sudamericana. Yet to see the dead. Luciano Herrera will produce something a uh, little more attacking. If that will just allow Pogarin to slot a touch deeper if it's Kevin Lopez who has made his way off as we get this second half underway and the Argentinian visitors to Peru. The yellow strip playing from right to left on your screen. And the Peruvian team's boss is Decided to go with experience. Fernandez. Opportunity to get a glancing flick. It's well played by Zapata just to put off the clearance and it's behind for a corner. It's a lovely touch by Herrera. Gets around his man. Turned in by the Colombian. Zapata's there. And Zapata gives Defensa Justicia the breakthrough in the blink of an eye. It all came from Luciano Herrera's strike that just wasn't dealt with by Carlos Grados. Didn't intend to fumble it out like that. But once he did, it just allowed the 23-year-old to dart onto it. Just his second game for his new side. There's his first goal for his new club. Fernandez looking just for that layoff for Bogarin. Might be a chance though, suddenly for the host. Vélez can't get onto it. This will go as anyway. He's on the edge, isn't he? Looks 
Soto just needs to feed it through. Palavicino rounds the keeper. What an opportunity. Immediate up. You knew he wasn't going to finish it either. Just took it that touch too wide and he rushed it with the ball underneath his feet. And they're moving it on. Gets shifted out to that left flank. Guerrero. Gets a break perhaps that he hopes to get. Mena. Guerrero. Too much. Back across goal for Mena. And another one slips past him. This one may be more difficult. But that's... Herrera back on his feet. Mena, third time's the charm perhaps, drags it all the way across goal. It wasn't going on target, I'm not really sure if it was a shot or a cross, but it was cleared away, irregardless, by Calderon. Asquez coming back. Herrera runs selfish. It's a good save that by Grados. But he wasn't really forced into anything too testing. Godoy comes down with it. He's leaning back, he's a long way out. You can... Might run kindly for Herrera, just about held up. Checks inside, fantastic save. As good a save as you'll see. Looks like Ezekiel Canavo is going to come on instead, the right back for defence at Eustisia. They need as many defensive bodies as they can. To make sure they don't come up short right at the end. Guerrero with the header. Hasn't had many of those, might not get many more. Never really got in front and got away from Elias Calderon, who's done a great job since coming on in this second half. Mena nods it down. Mena going for it again. Still not coming away with it. Half a shout for a penalty. We've got two players down on the deck. He's taking three defenders into the equation and out again. Lay back for Soto. Almost sealed it. I haven't seen enough of this from Defensor Justicia this evening.